this tutorial, I want to go over how to install WordPress on your HostGator.com account through Quick Install. To begin, you'll need to log into your HostGator control panel, and typically that'll be your domain name slash cPanel. And you'll enter in your username and password. All right, once you're logged in, scroll down to the software slash services section and click on the quick install icon. Under blog software on the left, click on WordPress and then click on continue. And you'll see here in the first box, this is, will be the folder that you install WordPress to. And in our case, we'll do slash my blog. But if you leave this blank, it'll install it to the root of your account. Um, obviously, that's not a good idea if you already have a website there. But if you don't, uh, WordPress can definitely be your main site. Admin email, make sure this is a valid email address because your password will be emailed here. And the rest of the uh, drop down boxes you can leave at default. Blog title can really be anything you'd like and enter in your first and last name. Now go ahead and click install now. And quick install will be downloading WordPress. It'll set up your databases and set up your configuration files to connect to WordPress. All right, now that it's installed, go ahead and click here and this will load your new blog. You can see it's installed to slash my blog. That was the path we put into quick install and WordPress is set up. Now you'll want to check your email and find the email quick install sent to you. It's going to look something like this and you'll want to grab that password, copy it, and in the browser you want to go to wp-admin after that uh, after your your full URL path for WordPress. Hit enter and log in with the username admin and paste that password. Click login and you're now on the WordPress backend. So one of the things you might want to do initially is reset your admin password by clicking users. And click edit under your username admin. Scroll down and you can input a new password here and click update profile. So if we go back to the dashboard, we can write a quick blog post right from quick press on the right here and my first blog post could be the title and the content alright now all you have to do is click publish and click view post and you can see the blog post right here and if you go to home on your blog you'll see the listings of all your posts.